First at 10, Cobb County Police are searching for a woman who's been impersonating law enforcement, and they say she's claiming to be with the GBI. Good evening, and thank you for joining us. I'm Russ Spencer. I'm Courtney Bryant. The woman in question has been spotted on home surveillance video. Uh, Fox Rise Denise Dillon joins us live tonight. Denise, you talked to one couple who says the woman showed up at their home. Yeah, it was late at night. There was a knock at the door. The woman saying she was with the GBI and looking for someone. The homeowners say it was frightening. And now police are looking for this impersonator. I was looking for the crooks, I mean the coward president. A stranger at the front door saying she's with the GBI. Wasn't there Tracy Allen with the GBI is, last, is looking for him? It was just alarming to hear somebody at your door that late at night claiming to be the GBI and they're after somebody. Stevie and Chad Levine's doorbell video shows the woman at their door. They couldn't help but notice something tucked in the waistband of her pants. It looked like a gun holster to me and the way it was tucked also inside of her pants and the way her shirt's like laying over it. I refused to open any doors, told my kids to get back. Chad Levine tried to warn his neighborhood to be on the lookout for the woman, but others had already posted similar encounters. Somebody else just posted the same exact video from a different house, and I was like, oh my goodness, what's going on here? That's, that's when my wife was calling the cops at that time. This becomes a problem when you have someone actually identifying themselves as a police officer, uh, because Number one, they're, if they're not a police officer, what are their true intentions? Cobb County police say even an undercover officer will always have some form of ID. Police have identified this woman as Tracy Allen. There's a warrant out for her arrest on charges of impersonating an officer. The Levines say while it was shocking, they didn't fall for her story. Knock on somebody's door and present to be law enforcement, you know, with no markings or anything at that time of night. I was like, there's just no way. I don't think anybody would wear those pants and be in the GBI. Now, Dallas police say they have heard about this woman as well. They say they were notified that she had made posts on social media threatening law enforcement agencies in Cobb County.